Hey everybody, BTO Pro here. Uh, I feel like maybe we need to get out from behind these avatars. I mean, I love DrupalCon and all, uh, but woo! Let's step into the real world for a minute uh, and be real people. So I'm not BTO Pro in real life, IRL. I'm uh, Brian Olandike. I'm a web developer at a university. Uh, I've been in the Drupal project for 11 years. And I love this community and really love the, what I can do with the platform. Uh, people think I'm like running a religion or something at times because I just keep, it's an evangelizing. I go, oh, oh, hi, how are you doing? I got, um, I'm crazy for Drupal. I have been for a long time. I wrote my thesis on Drupal and how I got um, a certain university to use Drupal um, quite a bit. Um, I've been contributing a lot to Drupal.org and the contrib communities. I don't get involved in core development quite as much because I just don't have that many hours in the day. Um, I have a family. Uh, I previously coached a, a national championship roller hockey team. Um, so why am I rambling? Well, we're all real people and I feel like we all need to kind of get to know each other a little bit better. Uh, DrupalCon Baltimore com is coming up very soon. Very excited. Um, and I feel like our community kind of in a weird place right now. Um, and so I don't know, whenever I'm in a weird place, I, I usually donate money and, uh, try to help other people. Um, I, or, or just talk about how I feel. So, I mean, I, I know that I use Drupal and I contribute to open source cause I fundamentally believe that it's able to change the world. Um, and I, I work in education because I feel like open source, uh, is able to reduce the cost of solutions. It's able to provide better outcomes for learners and bring people closer together. You know, uh, if you have freer systems and you can work on the ground with people, um, you can implement those for them. Uh, ultimately, you can reduce the cost of education if the systems required now to deliver education uh, don't cost anything. Um, <laughs> so, um, I'd like to you know challenge you to maybe say something about yourself, um, you know, show that we're all real people, and that's part of what makes the Drupal community great. It's it's a weird group of people. Uh, I've never really felt like I fit in anywhere else uh, my whole life, being bullied pretty severely growing up, um, and so uh, Drupal has really been really been a home for me. It's it's a great. Great community of people, people working towards a goal of just making systems uh, freer beyond, you know, the usual, hey, let's write good code. Um, it's, you know, it's, it's about community. So I encourage you to do something uh, either to, you know, help improve the community or to improve the world around you. Um, to, uh, you know, I'd like to challenge you to, you know, make a donation, whether it's a Drupal association or to you know the linux foundation or some some open source cause it doesn't have to be open source some cause that's important to you um, i think it's really important that we give back to society part of the way i give back every day is through open source and through drupal um, but today i'll be making a uh, hundred dollar donation to um, my you know favorite charity to donate to it's unfortunate this charity has to exist <laughs> but um, it's called operation underground railroad um, I'm going to leave a link in the video, uh, but they help break up uh, sex trafficking rings and uh, free kids from, from the sex slavery industry. Um, so uh, I would just I'd really encourage you to donate either to that or to some cause that you think is going to make the world a better place. Because the reason I work on Drupal every day is that I think I can make the world a better place. So nice getting to know you. Once you post a video. Bye.